What's up everybody, Sambo here. Welcome to Rock Valley. We are in this lovely cold map, something a little bit different. And so welcome to, what is this, episode five of City Fix. We're going strong and you guys are really enjoying it, which is really cool. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it so far. Just quickly, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button if you'd like to see more of these types of videos. And also if you'd like to submit your city, yeah, definitely go ahead, send it over. First of all, just upload it to the Steam Workshop and then copy the link at the top of the screen and then just send that to me either via Steam or in the comments below or on my my Instagram. So if you thought last episode was bad, ooh, okay, this one is, a, it, this one's a little bit worse. Okay, just a little bit. Now let's go up here, check on that traffic percentage. Ooh, I, oh my God, we're on 21%. So <laughs> why don't we just go through all of like the bad areas and get all the, ugh, the, ugh, the, you know, all that stuff out of the way first. Oh my God. Oh my god, that intersection. Oh my god, the whole thing. <laughs> what a mess. That, oh my god, it's just so bad. No offense, but it's just, oh, the traffic. Uh, we have a lot of traffic build up, and I have basically discovered the whole thing comes back to this intersection right here, the whole map. All of the traffic is caused by this one little bit right here. So there is a traffic light here and there's a traffic light here. And that's the whole reason why this whole city is having an issue. So what we're going to do first of all is fix up this. And I was also, I also want to look at the, what's this, the monorail as well. Continue that over, see how we go. So what, what the issue is here is you have all this traffic coming in and it all has to funnel down into one lane because all of them are wanting to turn down into here. And so you have all of this traffic, look at it all, all of it. It's just coming down and it's taking too long because of these traffic lights. And you have this street here, which kind of goes nowhere. So I'm actually going to demolish that. We don't really need that. If you want that in the future, go ahead. Um, and then I'm also going to remove the traffic lights here because these are what's causing the issues, right? And since we have all this traffic coming in, we're going to allow them to go a lot faster. So this one can go there, there, and then these two lanes can... Actually, maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should actually downgrade it to three lanes because we don't need all these lanes, to be honest. So let's go just the... Actually, we might do six lanes. Um, is this six lanes? Six lanes it is, yes. Okay, so I want to give this intersection, uh, well actually I should say I want to give this road here the priority over this whole intersection, so that's why I'm making them all just turn in here. Now, if they want to go to right here, it's really easy, they can just go around the block and then they're there, not really much of an issue. Um, this traffic will sh should go and then I'll make these guys over here give way because there's not really much traffic coming from that way. Now, also I'm just going to remove the intersection thingy my bob what is this called this button here i don't know what it's called exactly so now that that's flowing a little bit better oh look at those angles though really but anyway even the, anyway um you can see that the, the tr <laughs> sorry i have to fix this this is really annoying me the the heights i noticed this is like throughout the whole city these really weird heights do you not know what the movement mod is just saying maybe you should have a look at that anyway uh we should adjust these thingy my bobbies here just to make the flow a little bit easier um now we've got all of these we've got two lanes here i mean we've got three lanes here so i might downgrade that to two lanes because really we don't need that much so that will come in there nicely and then we'll just adjust the lanes so they don't go too crazy with all the crisscrossing and merging and stuff like that okay so how is that going actually i might just remove the intersection here as well great fantastic look at that flow this is how it should be so when you have such a huge highway connection you, you need a good flow and that's why i always say 
put a roundabout at the entrance of your city because there's going to be a lot of cars coming in and out, crossing over, going everywhere. And why not just give them the, the easy flow? Now, another really big issue that you have here is you have, I just close that. You have this main highway that goes along here, right? And suddenly they all have to merge off into this one single little lane. They come around here and then they have to get back on the highway for maybe, I don't know, 30 meters or something. And then they have to get back off. So what's happening here is you have all of this traffic entering the highway and they're entering in this lane usually. And then what's already happening is these cars are coming along and then they need to merge into this single lane here to get off the highway. So then you have these two groups of different traffic coming in here, merging and it's just slowing down so much traffic. So what we really need to do here is remove this highway entrance and put it in front of this exit here. But we also need to make sure that this road has access to get over to here. Okay, so I've just made it really quickly. So uh, originally it went here, but now I've moved it over to here and we have this bit here that breaks off. And what I want to do, what I, I should have thought of this earlier, but this should be upgraded to two lanes. So then they don't have to really merge across each other. And then this one breaks off here. So then it goes back into single lanes and then it probably should upgrade into two lanes over here, which then we will need to upgrade this to four lanes. We'll have to adjust this. And then we'll also have to add in another lane over here. Okay, now a sneaky, sneaky little traffic light has appeared. Look at that. Why would that come up? So we get rid of him. Good, he is gone. Now, all the lanes here, why is one of the lanes missing? Yeah, it's there, okay. Uh, now we've got a bit of a traffic jam. I think we need to remove the intersections again, no? What's going on? Why are we slowing down so much? But anyway, look at look at that. That's a huge improvement though. You gotta admit that. So let's leave this area for now and we'll move on to the next one. Now I'm noticing a huge influx of traffic going up here. Where are they going? Okay, over to here. Okay, wait a second. We have a traffic, uh, we have a power issue. I think what the issue was, yeah, you have this big power generator, but you forgot to connect it. There we go, that should help. I'm just wondering, did that did that improve the traffic flow at all? 23%, okay, we're getting there, we're getting there slowly, but look, that's kind of, that's cleared itself up a lot. Okay, let's go down here, and yeah, oh my god. So it looks like you've tried to do a little bit of organizing, but it's just not working out. So let's have a look, what is the issue? Um, Mm-hmm. Okay, what I want to do here is I want to remove these existing highway roads. So we're going to still have these, these little connections here. But what I want to do is I want to continue this main road because like this is a pretty main road. It goes all the way down here. And so why don't we continue it over the highway and connect it up here. Maybe we'll make a roundabout here, kind of following those there already. Um, so like I said, the highway connections will still be on. And because if we look at the city, there's no roads that just go over the highway. All of them connect to the highway, which is a really big issue a lot of you all keep doing. You forget to just do ordinary bypasses. Okay, so just to make it more simple, I'm going to use the connection point as a two lane road. So going one way, so they can just go down there like that. And then this one here will connect on like so. Now we just have to reverse that around. And actually we might downgrade that to one because that'll make it flow a lot easier. Now let me just adjust that mess off and then flip that. And then we'll just do the same on the other side as well. Now, of course we need to manage it. We can't leave it like this, right? So we need to make sure that they only go where they're supposed to go. So these guys can go right, there we go. Um, depending on how much traffic is coming from this way, we, we may need to upgrade these amounts of lanes, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. We'll see. Um, now this one, that lane, we need to get rid of that one so they can't turn that way. And then over here, this one, did I see? No, I think that's, that's fine, I think. And then we're also just going to remove the intersection thingy there. And I just did a simple connection for now. We'll just see how that goes. And now this mess, oh, really? Come on, what's going on? So basically just remove these intersections. That'll really help the flow, help it go. Um, will I need to, I'm actually, I might 
make these guys give way since this is the highway road so we're going to give priority to the highway access point now come down here what's going on oh yeah I forgot I need to adjust these lanes so obviously this lane here should go to that one and then this one here will go to that one and I'm just gonna be sneaky to get them going I'm just going to delete a few so they start going there we go look at that flow oh look at that oh run over a few people oh well then they go straight in okay first of all I am going to remove pedestrian crossings because they should not be crossing here we'll give them an elevated walkway in a second so we'll just turn all of that off and that one as well and that one and so there's already this this one here but yeah I think it, it needs to be elevated because it's just stopping the traffic too much oh my god dare I dare I I'm so tempted right now I don't know why they're ignoring my rules I don't know what is happening dare I I really want to click no I better not I better not looks like the flow is kind of going a little bit better um yeah I, th Ugh. I know you can press ctrl s everyone says press ctrl s ctrl s but it doesn't do anything to stop the lane merging so it's a big issue like they do these weird lane changes and it really just wrecks everything it makes it really clunky okay so while that's just doing its thing it's slowly like there's a bit of a flow happening so that's great what I want to do down here is maybe let's just add in a little just a sneaky little entry point Okay guys, so I added in this little entry point here, so there's an entry point from both sides of the highway. As of right now, nothing is really happening. I think I've made it worse. Like, what is, we'll check what's going on down here. But I thought it might be good to have this little entrance point just to give them another little option. Uh, might take them a while because they're kind of stuck in traffic, but what is going on down here? This is, okay, I, th I think we need to remove this from here, I'm sorry, but I think it has to go. It's just causing too much of an issue. Too much, too much. Look at that. Now the traffic is going because it was backing up all in here. Wow, it was backing all the way up there. Jeez. Jesus. Oh my God. But on the other hand, this area here is now clear. Look at this. Clear roads. We've got a couple of cars going through here, so that's really great. Um, what's going on over here? Ah, oh, why don't we do that? Why don't we... I know this is like becoming a lot, but why don't we add in a little entry point there? Maybe some of them will use that. It's just like, it, we did, I mean, we have the space. We do have the space. Now, this is still an issue here. Okay, I think I'm just gonna let it run for a while and let the traffic clear up a bit because it's so backed up that, ugh, it's just a mess right now. It's a mess, it, needs, it just needs to play out. Okay guys, so it's been playing for about probably seven to eight minutes and look at that, look at the difference that made, so just letting it play out for a while, look at this, this used to be so, basically that was, that was a complete mess, uh, this intersection here, complete mess, I really think this road here has made such a huge difference, it really has, um, the highway is no longer also and like down here is also flowing really well and it's crazy how just having these these two traffic lights here it's amazing how much of an impact that had so always make sure that there's not a sneaky little one and I think it's also important when you have traffic issues just track back where it's all coming from where it all stops from if that makes sense bad English but yeah you have to really go back but this area here is still annoying me I think it's the last area I mean 72% late look at that so good um, down here a little bit of a mess not too bad over here is fine um, okay oh yeah I didn't put in these lanes here by the way the person who made this map did now I'm wondering why you didn't manage it why didn't you manage it? So you have all these lanes here, but nothing is happening. So let's just, I'll just do it quickly for you. So you have this one that goes, um, actually we have to do it this way. You, since you have this lane here, we don't want them to be able to turn right. Okay, so that they can't turn right. Now, what else do we need to do? This lane, you looks like you've done it. So that one can go that way. Um, that one 
Okay, so this little lane here should only be able to go straight ahead. Um, that looks fine, that merges in there. Now, we don't want this one to be able to turn right because you have this lane here, so we'll close that. So they should all start using that in a second. And uh, what else is there? This one, oh, this one here. So you have this lane here, so this one shouldn't be able to turn right. Um, I think, th what's, where's this one? What's this one doing? Oh, uh, is that one going from over here? Okay, that's good. I mean, I like this. This is good. So, that means they can't turn right here. If this van moves, I can see if they... Yeah, we need to remove that. So, we can't make... We can't allow these guys... Oops. We can't allow this lane here to turn left because they have that lane there all ready to go. And I think... Oh, look at that go. Well, I'm kind of like, why didn't you add in a lane over here? Let's just do it anyway. I'll do it for you do it since there's so much traffic here a lot of it's going over here to connect to the highway actually where is it coming from it's coming from down here okay interesting so we'll use this existing connection and uh, I guess maybe we'll just do it there it's not that good but generally like you can get the principle of what I'm doing so they should all start zooming up here what is this what is that oh that's a pillar I'll move that for you buddy I'll move that there you go now, what's going on here? Oh yeah, I need to remove... Actually, actually keeping in with the theme, so we'll move this one over to... Oops. We'll move that one over to there, so they can't go up here and turn right. There we go. Good. So... I mean, it's messy, but I mean, this is what the guy was doing already. So that's going to help with that. Now let's go back over to here. Any issues? This big part here is going all right. Uh, what's this? We've got this lane here. Okay. Why don't we downgrade that to one lane? Because we don't really need two lanes. I mean, we don't really need it. And then we'll come down here and we'll just give them their own little lane to enter. Looks like you've already done it, so that's good. So they can go in there, they don't really bother anyone. Um, and then coming up here, actually, we'll update this one to four lanes. So we have a merging entry lane. Oh, we've got a traffic issue. Interesting. And then just before I go check out what the issue is, this, oh, it's two lanes, is it? We only need one lane, to be honest. We don't need two lanes. There we go, good, 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 and then so, these lanes go over here, and then this lane will have this lane over here. Okay, what is the issue up here? What's wrong this time? What's wrong? Okay, so, we have this, oh, wait, what's this? Oh, I see what, okay, it's a little bit messy, but this comes over here, so let's downgrade that to one, because we only really need one. Bring that in, because you have two lanes here. We'll downgrade this to one lane as well, so we can just make them merge easier. And don't you just love this tool? I love this tool. Imagine if we didn't have Traffic Manager at all. <gasps> oh my god, that would be horrible. So they can come down here. Now, I'm going to just say no right, no left turn, sorry they can go down that's an easier flow um, now this looks like a bit of an issue here okay so you have this entry point here so I'm going to say is this one way by the way it is so I'm going to say for these guys here maybe just go straight ahead for now um, instead of turning in there because it's causing a bit of an issue turn off the traffic light so they kind of just go there we go Guys, I finally worked out what the issue was. It's this stop sign. Now, it's not the traffic manager stop sign. It's the actual in-game. Boom. Gone. It was slowing them down. I was like, what is going on? And I was like, I was like, should I, should I get that meteor? Like, should I summon that meteor? Oof, I, but okay. That, that really helped. <laughs> so, yeah, because I saw a little sign and I was like, what is that? No, it couldn't be. It was, it was, it was a little stop sign, and now there's all this traffic, but I think it's going to be okay. It's going to be a lot better now. 
Okay guys, just quickly before I wrap up the episode, you might be thinking, wow, that's a lot of, a lot of lanes. Um, what I did was, since what I did was the fourth lane is basically what I did, did in the last video. So if there's a car that wants to go from here, for example, over to here, they have this priority lane here, which is only for them. So other cars in here, they won't use these lanes. So I've done that in all of them. It's basically the same as doing a slip road. So for example, a road that goes from here and zooms over here. It's basically the same, but I've just connected it in and I've adjusted it all. So it hopefully doesn't become too much of an issue, but it looks like it's flying pretty well. Um, there's a lot of traffic in this area, so yeah, I'm pretty proud of that. The only last thing that I need to do is just add in the pedestrian crossings. But other than that, I think that's it for this video. Well, there we go, you guys. I just threw on that pedestrian crossing really quickly, but uh, overall, the traffic percentage has gone down to... Well, actually, I should say gone up to 75%. So what was it at? About 20 or something. So that was really bad. Um, much worse than the last video. I mean, there's still little red patches, but generally the traffic flow is still okay. Um, it's not as bad as how it was. Now, I was going to initially continue the monorail from here over to the university, but for now, I am i don't think I'm going to bother. It was only like a last resort type of thing if, if I didn't blow up the city, which I almost did. But, yeah, so the traffic does fluctuate through here. Um, it's okay over here. The highways are okay. That toll booth, oh, that toll booth was, that toll booth was horrible. And um, down here seems to be okay. So I think that's generally it for this city. That Wow, look at that traffic flow. Doesn't it look good? So, thank you guys for watching. And now, just to, I'll just say it one more time quickly. If you want to send me your city, please do. Um, a lot of you guys have been sending it, and apologies if I don't reply. There's just so many coming in. But please do send them in. You can just upload it to Steam. Send me the link via the description below on Steam or on Instagram. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode.